What's good, Humble Squad? It's your boy Humble Ziggy. I'm back in here with another video. And today, ah boy, with this one, man. This is Dax again. We're basically back with Dax. And we're here with Dax Britney Spears Toxic Remix. Now, so he basically posts this on his Instagram and on his community tabs on like YouTube and such on his page. Basically talking about how he's gonna switch genres and such just for a little I guess like funny act or whatnot, but it is what it is. But god damn it. This nigga when I tell y'all he goes to when I say he commits to whenever he does for his fans, bro, he commits it to a whole, whole nother level. Like, what the hell? Like, this, if I could, I don't even know. I'll, I'll let y'all see for yourself. It's like this, y'all. Britney Spears? Really? When did, when? Apparently this some hash apparently Britney Spears is in jail. Is this true? Hold on. I'm looking this up. If Britney Spears is actually in jail. Cause well I don't know. With the way how he puts this about how free hashtag free Britney, whatever that means. Unless he's joking around it, but hold on, let me see. Let me see. Let me see here. Well, she's known as the princess of pop, I guess. But hold on, let me see here. Hold on, give me a second. Guys, with this free Britney thing, I want to see what this. So I basically, I'm literally on Google right now searching about this thing. I just searched up Britney Spears jail and this is what pops up. And one of the people also asked a little tab there says about why are people saying free Britney? And this just popped up saying her statement comes after fans took to social media expressing they're worried that the pop star is being stifled not only from her conver conversation ship work but also through her own social media acts. Britney creates her own posts her own posts and writes her own captions on her Instagram and so basically I don't know. I, there's some kind of movement I guess with her so I'm like let me see what say there's one that says what happens saying despite being unable to handle her own affairs this continues to work after successfully rehabilitating her image with a successful seven studio album and seven appearances on television she begins a four-year concert residency in las vegas apparently there was some controversy or so with this whole thing so I don't know like whatever this thing is about it is what it is but either way man when it comes to Dax he be entertaining as hell with these so maybe it's gonna be a good thing maybe it's gonna be a bad thing maybe it's gonna be a some sort of thing I don't know but either way we about to check this music video out make sure you like comment and subscribe and without further ado let's get in the video It's like, oh my god, bitch, did you hear about the fucking rapper Dax? Like, dude, all he fucking talks about is, like, being a fucking janitor. Like, he thinks he's so fucking dope. He's garbage, babe. Babe, he's fucking us. Babe, he's garbage. Yeah, can't touch the flow, it's too toxic. Can't see the vision, yo, optics. Got bird from constantly watching Instagram and... Hold up, hold up. Hold on. Let me fix my headphones here. Hold on. Why is he... Why all of... What in the world? First of all, what the hell is this? 
Like, what the hell? No, he's garbage, babe. Babe, he's fucking up. Babe, he's garbage. Yeah, can't touch the flow, it's too toxic. Can't see the vision, your optics. Got bird from constantly watching Instagram in everyone's pockets. I promise it don't drive you psychotic. The aftermath, like Dr. Dre's chronic. It's total depression and constant assessment of one's inner value and outward appearance. Uh, fuck. What the hell? Okay, one. Again. What the hell? Two. Why does this slap all of a sudden? <laughs> like, how does this... I don't understand, but... He's coming with the bars as usual. Math the Dr. Dre's chronic is total depression and constant assessment of one's inner value and outward appearance. Uh, fuck niggas always speaking on my name. I divide the hate, they multiply the fame. My grip's so tight, I can wreck the game. So foul my shit, like insurance claims. Mmm. My grip's so tight, I could ref the game. So foul my shit in like foul my shit like insurance claims. Like it's a good I don't care what anybody say. I want to put the caption in so that way I can understand it more better. So foul, like two meanings right there. Foul, like the ref game, and foul, like insurance claims and such. Mm. My all is enough for my mental state is the farm that breathes exponential hate. So I sit back, grab a Kit Kat, take a break. I'm a Big Mac, but don't make sticks. I ain't gay, daddy. I'm a big dog, pen game prey. I don't see you fish if I do it's fillet. You people me know I'm petit français. Quand je parle, parle pas, tu n'es pas concret. On y va. So this nigga now can sp So not only this nigga can rap Fast and such Now this nigga can speak This nigga now can speak French You fish if I do is filet You people me know I'm petit français Quand je parle pas le tu n'es pas concret On y va quand je rap Et ce cause t'en fait Quand c'est con C'est un homme qui est con Oui oui j'ai une grosse tête Mais tu peux pas rapper avec moi man What in the Napoleon What the hell Look here, when I was in high school, I studied Spanish. I didn't know about no French. I could say a few little things or so, I guess, in Spanish and such. But let's face it, we all, if you was, if you were me, we all know we had to, like, try to find, a, like, had to look up on our phones or so, like, for this translation and such. That's the only, that's the way how I did it. But, nigga, our school... Hollandale did our school did not have this. Did not have a first. The nun kid coming on pad. We be saying cross pad, man. You better pop that pad, that woman. Oh my God, bitch! Did you know he spoke French too? Yeah, bilingual single rap god. Wanna fuck? You can find me on Christian Mingle. My mistletoe make a hole like Pringle. Sing on my pipe like a Christmas jingle. I botox these find every wrinkle. I don't do pop if I do with pimple. This black. Mmm, I don't do pop if I do its pimples. Like pop your pimples and such. These black heads full, never, I never be simple. See, it be some of the craziest bars and such when it comes to Dax. And it be so funny and just outlandish because you never hear other rappers talk, rap something like this. Just crazy. Sing on my pipe like a Christmas jingle. I Botox these find every wrinkle. I don't do pop if I do with people. This black head's full. I've never been simple. I'm proactive in my workplace nimble. I'm twice the cost. My independent stock. Close the game but I'm still not on top. All the chicken that I get and got like a rooster sin. And then because I talk up doodle along these other people's songs. They're mid. I night them like the crack of dawn. They hate the night. Come back and just respond with bars they can't detect because they're drawn to rap cap. Trap beats with a hi hat. Why does everyone like that? I mean Dax Shop says that it's so hard that you just might need an ice pack. Oh my god, bitch, he's got me rapping too. He's so motivational. <laughs> I'll bless the game, the bars are pointed to. Pierce your body like a new tattoo. I hip and hop all over every tune so much the shot. Look here, I'm just only focusing on the bars. I don't care. I will not want to see what the hell he's doing here, but let's just focus on the bars. Not this. <laughs> but I bless the game. I bless the game, the bars, I point, I chew, I chew, sneeze, at you. The bars I point at you, pierce your body like a new tattoo. Pierce your body like a new tattoo. I hip hop, hip hop on all over every tune so much. Hip hop, the genre. Man. I hip and hop all over every tune so much the genre wants to see me lose But once I pop I promise they'll resume to rock and roll with me just to amuse the country So they tricked into a boost to punk your mind and tune into The way how he's using different genres of music 
into a rhyme scheme. He used pop, blues, hip, rock and roll, hip hop. Like, come on. Like, listen to the rhyme. Listen to the scheme. Listen, basically, listen to the genre scheme right here. You basically go into every single one. I hip hop all over the tune. I hip and hop all over and redo so much the genre wants. So much the genre wants to see me lose. Like, generation. Like, general or so. To see me lose, but once I pop up. Once I pop, pop music. Promise they'll resume to rock and roll with me. Rock and roll. He just threw a lose the country, so they tricked into a lose to punk your mind and tune into the news. Oh my god, bitch. He just named seven music genres. Which one's he gonna do? K pop, maybe. Techno, baby. Reggae music, cause it's super wavy. Emo's dope, but then they think I'm crazy and probably won't attract too many ladies. Christian music's lit, but I cuss so pastors probably are not gonna play me when technically my lyrics teach and preach that same things that you're speaking on the days. So and the thing is, this is. And that po and I saw this on his Instagram, that little on his story where he had that exam thing right there. It's kind of weird too, cause even though my pastor preaches about that too, hear me out. Christian music, like Christian hip hop music and such, right? I listen to that, and it's and it has the same kind of ways like this does. It's just wavy and it has a good message. But it's like this. I feel like just because that. Even if you're a Christian, right? All I'm saying, this is hear me out. Even though if you're a Christian and all, and if you listen to music that even though it has some curse words in it, technically, just because you sh you can't just block out what he said, what the rapper is talking about, just because of the curse words, because nine times out of ten, they speak in the exact same thing. That you're speaking. They just do it in their way. But either way, you're speaking it in the same way. So that's why I always feel like no matter what genre of music I listen to, whether it's the Christian hip-hop, the lyrical ones, or whatever, one way or another, each one finds a way how to speak the same topic or so. They just do it in their different times. Pastors probably are not gonna play me when technically my lyrics teach and preach the same things that you're speaking on the day. So fuck the genres, it's all subjective. Suppress the flow that's not cost effective. PhD with my flow finessing, so I don't care if I'm not a freshman. Listen up, cause this class is session is expert. Hold on, because I'm not a freshman. Double XL. That you're speaking on the day, so fuck the genres, it's all subjective. Suppress the flow that's not cost effective. PhD with my flow finessing, so I don't care if I'm not a freshman. Listen up, cause this class and session is exponentially so progressive and pushing rap to an esoteric, like unreachable fourth dimension. That's me. Yeah, don't you ever try to play me, nigga. I just started rapping, I promise that I'm getting bigger. Every bar that I spit flips, I Britney spear the game with my scripts. I spit so much. I Britney spear the game with my scripts. I spit so much. Hold up. I just started rapping, I promise that I'm getting bigger Every bar that I spit flips, I've written me Spear the game with my scripts, I spit so much shit That I could drown 20 clips in my drip Then take my whole fist and stick it so far up down And go all around and still sell a bit Then get rich, got my spit mm, Still sell a bit Sell a bit In my drip, then take my whole fist and stick He basically went down to, you know, the if you know what, if you know, you know. Get so far up down and go all around and still sell a bit and get rich. Don't listen to my <laughs> bitch, bitch. Did you hear that? Oh, I'm gonna send him a DM. He changed my life. <laughs> oh my god, he replied, bitch. He fucking replied. Oh my god, he's such a good person. Like, like who takes the time to do that? Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah that's what I do. Go on and on like Erica Badu. I've evolved so much, can't peek at you, so I don't see no beef unless I'm in the studio. Pikachu, the Pikachu bar. Go on and on like Erica Bad. It's like this. No matter how crazy or wacky his music videos be, you gotta peep the messages though. I have evolved so much, can't peek at you, so I don't see no beef unless I'm in the stoop. Cooking up to a level they cannot reach. I enslave these beats as a masterpiece. People sell up in the game with a nasty tweet, but they focused on me so they can't compete. They are not to me, my anatomy to me is the offspring of a rap god mixed breeds of the 13th power of the 21st tree and a sequence known as the Fibonacci of the 34th bar. You're a 7 under part time, 7 plus 6 because your stroke game's weak. This ain't rap, little nigga. This is big dick speech and that's how I come hard every goddamn beat. Oh my god, bitch. So you're not gonna believe this, but like Dax DM me. And really? Really? Bitch. That's not the unbelievable part. Like, we DM all the time now. It's like a normal thing. It's sort of just like something we have between us. Like, you wouldn't understand because like... He doesn't really fuck with you. But anyways, so Dak DM me and he said that this is all just a warm up and that it's over for these fuck boys. <laughs> no, 
but, but, but wait, wait, wait. He also said, now get this, that he's currently making his first album. <laughs> first, first album. I need more excitement, bitch. You're just not, okay. Dax, we can't fuck with him. <laughs> what the hell? Metro by T Mobile. What in the Britney Spears is going on here? But hey, man, he gonna have his next album coming? Hey, we all for that now. But bro, even though Pride Month was yes, even though Pride Month is technically over, what the hell? <laughs> like, nigga. What the hell is this? <laughs> but hey man, shout out to Dax again, always being crazy as hell with the videos. And crazy with the bars too, don't get it twisted. But hey man, once that album comes out, y'all already know I'm gonna be on that. But hey man, let me know what you think down in the comments below. It's been your boy Humble Ziggy signing out. Stay positive and keep the vibes up. Let go.